business we're working today on purchases grew up purchase Achrimos. Purchase by Achrimos, you find the avoda of the coin gadol. The coin gadol brings Hatos and Yom Kippur to bring Kapara for Kal Yisrael. The Pasuk says, the Hebrew Ba'adol Bad Yisrael Ba'ad Kal Kal Yisrael. It says, he's bringing Kapara for himself, the coin gadol, for his house, meaning his family, the Ba'ad Kal Kal Yisrael, and for all of Kal Yisrael. There's different Korbanas, some he offers first for himself, for his family, and for all of Kal Yisrael. The Pasuk has a difficulty. The Pasuk says, the Hebrew Ba'adol, that he is the one who brings up Kapara for himself. Now, really, Kapara comes from Hashem. So he does the action to bring the Korban, but Kapara has to come from Hashem. So the Rebbe the Yismach Moshe wants to say, Api Drash, Api Remez, Api Remez here, that we could read the Pasuk differently. Hashem's bringing the Kapara. Hashem's bringing the Kapara for himself, for his Hashem's house, and for Kahal Yisrael. I'll have to explain that term. What's it mean for himself? For himself, it means. He's bringing kapara for his own name to make himself holy to show he's the one who can give kapara. What does it mean by beso? His base of mikdash is destroyed. Therefore, he's bringing kapara for his base of mikdash. Ba'ad kol kal yisrael means he's going to bring all of kal yisrael together. Kahal means the gathering together when they come to the house of the kodesh baruch hu, and that is meant to be in the future. And this, I think, is what the Rebbe means to say the word v'havein, and you should understand this. I think what he means is there's a, le- and a, a level of Hillel Hashem. We don't see Hashem in the world. Really, Hashem's in the world. It's just hidden. We don't see it. So the kapara is we're eventually going to come to a time when we can see Hashem more clearly, and then we'll be able to fulfill and grow spiritually much more.